Alright, welcome everybody. It's uh, Captain Paxo from the future here. And uh, this is my new Lego Harry Potter Years 1 through 4 all bonus levels PB. Um, I'm recording this in post commentary like I usually do for these ones because I never stream uh, all bonus levels. Mostly because of the salt content that usually goes on behind the scenes. Uh, today I put about 250 attempts into this game. Uh, most of them I lost in uh, 7 and 8 because they're really hard levels. But uh, yeah, I told myself that this was going to be the last run no matter what happened. Uh, even if I'd come out of this and, you know, it died in the first level or something. This this was my last attempt, attempt number 400. Because uh, I originally told myself I was going to stop at 200 and then didn't. But yeah, so we have the first hard trick in the game here, getting nice fighter jump. Uh, yeah, got that pretty smoothly. But then, basically today, I learned a whole new strat for 7. Which makes it so much more difficult. I mean, this run didn't start off great. As you can see, 10 was 2 seconds behind. Um, but we start to claw it back here. This strat is really difficult though. So I'm going to go over to the right here. And I have to be really careful with my movement to try and load the Dementor so it goes onto that button. And from there I can then activate the button and collect the gold brick. But that is really difficult to try and do. Um, I actually golded that split. Which is pretty impressive. But yeah, that's a, probably the toughest trick in the run for me. At least the way I do things. Uh, and then these next levels are a little bit more simple. They're just a, a Lumos jump or two. Lumos jumping, where you um, activate Lumos, uh, switch off that spell, and you have a small frame, like uh, frame window, where you can actually do two jumps. Using that to gain extra height, get up to places you're not supposed to, as we do here. I'd say this level is probably the easiest one in the game. Uh, but yeah, somehow, almost didn't save time with it. But yeah, I, t I told myself that this was going to be... Well, I really wanted to get sub-310. Sub-310 was my goal. Uh, as you can see from the title of this video, we managed that. I think this is a 308. I think I just missed out on a uh, 307, even though I did split a bit earlier. Uh, of course, you have to retime it. But yeah, this is a really hard level. Uh, I actually dropped out beforehand. Normally, I don't do that, but it's a safer strat because you can actually see where you're going a bit more. Loses like half a second, maybe, if that. Uh, but makes both 3 and 2 a lot easier. As you can see, yeah, I, I lost that like 0.6 or whatever from dropping out. But it was a bit of safety. And at this point, I started to get quite nervous because I hadn't had a clean 2 all day. My 2s have been absolutely awful at the moment. Uh, but then we get to this run. And thankfully, I managed to get that jump off the edge there. Uh, and gold. Gold by 0.4, which is quite cool. Got my summer best down to a 3 flat, which is quite nice. And then we go into the final level. Uh, this final level was be better than the final level in my previous PB. Uh, in the sense that I remember to have extras on this time. However, I do do that, where I jump out the bus too early and end up being behind the bus. Uh, that's a mistake, don't do that. And then, yeah, we finish it up. It's a ridiculously quick run, but not too bad. So thank you for watching.